The cumulative gridding method assigns node values by adding the Z values for all control points that reside within the corresponding grid cell. This method is useful for modeling cumulative production or weighted occurrence data. Advantages useful for modeling cumulative data such as production, useful for mapping weighted occurrence data such as multi element geochemical data, disadvantages it's not intended for modeling structural surfaces or isopacks, and it cannot be used in conjunction with the declustering option.